Right, now that the walk cycle is basically finished, what we need to do now is have a proper look at it and make sure that we iron out any issues. So if we have a look at our walk cycle as it stands, particularly what's happening with the feet. So as I scroll through, let's watch this front foot. And as it comes back, there it's okay, but it's there, it's raising up off the ground, which shouldn't really happen. There it's all kinds of wonky. Um, and then somewhere it's raising off the ground there. That is well up in the air. So there's definitely some issues that we need to address. So I'm going to start with this foot. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to select everything in here. I'm going to press A. I'm going to select all my tangents, all my lines. And I'm going to set them all to spline because it appears that they didn't stay that way. I think that's going to give me a much smoother, um, a much smoother curve. Yeah, so that foot I'm actually kind of happy with. So there are a few places now where I need to go back in and make repairs. But I think for the whole, the whole thing, I'm going to select every single thing. Hang on. So let's select everything in here. Make sure I can see everything. Select all those curves. I'm just going to change them all to spline. Yep, so that's a few changes that have been made there. Right, let's see what that gives us. Yeah, so already that's much better and I just need to make a few tweaks. So, let's go back to this back foot and I can see that this issue here um, where the foot, in fact no, this one, the foot wobbles, there we go, so I need to sort that one out. So I'm going to select these two and I'm going to set that to linear and that'll give me a nice straight line. So I'll keep that foot planted. Yep, and I'll have the same issue on this foot over here. So let's set that to linear. Okay, let's play that back and see what that looks like now. From the front, that looks kind of tidy. Let's just turn the curves off. Okay, so through playing with the graph editor, there are definitely some more improvements that could be made to this. Uh, but I think for now, I'm happy enough with that. So there we go. Right, so that brings us to the end of this tutorial. Uh, I hope you've learned something. Obviously, in this one, we've only done um, a walk cycle on the legs. Uh, if you would like to see a full body walk cycle, then make sure you like this video, hit the subscribe button and leave a comment telling me that that's what you want to see. If you want the full body uh, tutorial, then say, hey Shane, where's the full body tutorial? And uh, when I find time, that'll be something that I'll add to my list of tutorials to make. If you have any problems with this or if you need help, um, then once a month I have video chats with my Patreon supporters. Uh, so they bring me problems, they ask me questions and I help them solve them, um, send me files etc. So if you'd like that kind of support then consider checking out the link below the video, checking out my Patreon campaign and maybe supporting me there. Uh, and that way you'll get access to me uh, much more one to one than simply through the YouTube comments uh, and I'll be able to help you out there. As well as that you will get the uh, handout, the, the written version of this exercise. Uh, which I'll make available to all my patrons. I want to say thanks to 3D.SK for sponsoring this video. You really should go and check out uh, their reference video section as well as their reference image as well. There's some really good stuff on there. The 3D capture stuff that they're doing is ridiculously good and that's something I want to play with in the future. Maybe I'll rig one of those characters up for, for a tutorial. But you should definitely check out uh, their site because it's really good. And one last thing, if you're watching this video because you're getting into animation, then you really need to make sure you understand the fundamentals. So for God's sake, buy this book. It's such a good book. Um, so it's by Richard Williams. It's called The Animator's Survival Kit. I will have a link in the video description. Uh, check it out. It'll be the best book you've ever bought, I promise. Okay, so that's me finished. Thanks for watching this one and I will see you in the next one.